Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Brandon. I am designer slash gamer, and today we're playing a brand new free demo game on Nintendo Switch, Dragon Quest Builders 2. Now this demo was just released a couple of days ago, and it is super cool, you guys. It's getting me really excited for the game. So today we're going to check it out. We're going to play through it. We're going to see how awesome it is, and... Uh, we're gonna play this game on Twitch in about two weeks when it comes out. Not even two weeks, 12 days, so get excited. So Dragon Quest Builders 2, a little bit about the game. It's an action role-playing sandbox game developed by Omega Force and Square Enix. This is coming from uh, Wikipedia. <laughs> it is the sequel to Dragon Quest Builders and was released in Japan in December 2018 and will be released worldwide July 2019. Dragon Quest Builders 2 features the ability for players to find materials and use them to construct buildings and other equipment. New features not found in the previous game include the ability to fly and travel underwater, as well as fast travel function based on a retro style map. Unlike the first Dragon Quest Builders, the game allows for up to four players to play together cooperatively. Oh my gosh, you guys, I can't wait. So we're going to explore the multiplayer aspect of this game for sure, but you know, because I'm a designer and I love to build, we're going to explore the building aspect of this game too. And it looks like the adventure game, the adventure aspect is pretty awesome too. Let's talk about the plot. Dragon Quest Builders 2 takes place sometime after the events of Dragon Quest 2 and centers around the group called the Children of Hargon, who seek to revenge the defeat uh, for the defeat of Hargon and Malroth by the descendants of Edric by ensuring that all builders are eliminated and that no one is allowed to create anything. Players control either male or female builder who is captured by this group along with all other builders in the world on a ship. The player character escapes washing up on the Isle of Awakening where they meet a person named Malroth who has no memory of this past. Malroth adds the player character in improving. Malroth aids the, the player character in improving their building powers. Oh my gosh, you guys. This sounds like so much fun. I can't wait to check it out. So I did already check it out, just to check it out. But we're going to play a brand new version right now. So we're going to start a new game. And you guys are gonna see how awesome this game is. I love it. Save data already exists, okay. Yes, we're gonna delete it because we're gonna start a brand new game. So you guys, you get to play the demo for a while. I mean, you go through it and the first part of it is kind of a guided demo, but the second part is all about building and you get to kind of hang out and build a lot. So we're gonna select male. We're gonna kind of make it look like me. So you know I have uh, brown hair. So let's scroll over, that's about the right shade. Yes, skin, that's probably about the right color. Eyes are going to be brown, just like my hair, brown eyes. Cool, okay, perfect. Let's go ahead and select it. And of course my name is B R A N D. I like the music you guys, it's cool, D O. Good, this is long enough for me to have my full name. Excellent, okay. Let's go ahead and hit okay. How do I, oh, okay, I have to go all the way through it. Okay, that's weird. Move cursor, all right. Finish, previous screen, select, delete. How do I, how do I get down here? Okay, that's it. Is this okay? Yes, are you happy with the character? You can change your character's appearance, gender, and name once you reach a certain point in the game, okay. Great. You can now adjust the game settings. Once you're happy, select confirm to save your changes and start the game. You will be able to change these. Okay, if we can change them later, let's just confirm it. We'll keep it all the same. Yes, I'm happy. I'm glad they give you so much control though. Do you guys see that? You can invert the camera, you can change buttons. That's great. I love games that give you uh, control over the controls. <laughs> okay, here we go, loading. There's a little onion turning pages, it looks like. I'm not sure what that's about, but okay. Here we go. Maybe? There we go. All right. Venture forth, my children, and destroy all before you. Whoa. Okay, is he talking to me? I'm not doing that. That sounds rude. Okay. <gasps> is this Malroth? Thus decreed the great and glorious High Priest Hargon. Oh, it's Hargon, sorry. 
And lo, his minions of mayhem did march out rank upon rank to ravage the land and strike fear into human hearts. This is intense, you guys. Look at those guys. I like the adventure aspect of this. It's great. What is that? Our unholy father then gave up his mortal form so that Malroth, the master of destruction, might be reborn and the world be consumed by catastrophe. Whoa! Okay, that's heavy. Alas, mighty Malroth was defeated at the hands of the despicable spawn of Edric before Hargon's glorious vision could be brought to life. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, those names, but hey. Look at his little sandals. <laughs> <laughs> and his big claws. <laughs> what happened? Probably what the text said, right? Yeah, okay. <gasps> the moon has waxed and waned many times since that fateful day. Now peace reigns supreme and our order has been scattered to the four corners of the earth. Builders, right? Tell me, brothers and sisters, what does a monster do when backed into a corner? It bites, I say. We must do everything and anything within our power to bring this world to ruin. Oh, wait. No, these are bad guys. These are monsters. Okay, got it. They're not builders. <laughs> They're not going to build anything. Huzzah, huzzah. All hail Hargon. Praise to be to praise be to Malroth. Okay. Oh, hellish father, hear our prayer. Deliver us from this world of oblivion. Whoa. Lead us ever onwards as we build your dominion of darkness together. I'm not building any dominions of darkness, so count me out of that. <laughs> Dragon Quest Builders 2. Here we go. I guess we get to play now, maybe? Maybe? Maybe, maybe? I don't know. Brandon, that's me. You are the hero who will save this world. Uh, well, uh, me? Me? Okay, I'll try. Arise, my child. Your destiny awaits. Okay. Oh, hey. Do I have to fight this guy? What, what are you doing? Leave me alone. Hey. Oh, man. Look at him. Keh, heh, heh. The look on your face. I was only ribbing you, my child. Does that mean joking? Oh, ribbing. I get it because he's a skeleton. He's got... Okay. You're no hero. Rude. I know that much. You are one of them builders, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's me. Kehehe, <laughs> you want to watch that mouth of yours, boy. Telling the truth might land you with more than you bargained for. Still, at least you're not a master builder. Like Lego. <laughs> you might actually, you might only be an apprentice, but that'll do. I'll actually, I've actually got just the job for a lad like you. Okay. Once you've wiped the sleep from your sockets. Saying I look tired. Come and meet me up on deck. Oh. Okay, I guess we'll go do that right now. Oh man, this is cool, you guys. Look at this. Oh, okay, so we use L to move your character just like every other game. R to control the camera, B to jump. Okay, so B, jump. Yay, I'm so glad we can jump. Some games like this, you can't actually jump, like, you know, old school Zelda games. But we can jump. Okay, so we can now leave. Let's open this door. Okay, ooh, that music's intense. <gasps> Look at this guy. Builder, builder, I have something to tell you. Did you know that you can run by holding R when you while you move around with L? I did not know that. I'm sure the extra speed will come in handy, but take care near high le ledges or you'll meet your maker sooner rather than later. Whoa, okay, that's good advice. So what do we do, you guys? Talk to this guy. Hi, builder, builder. Oh, he already. We already. Okay, we heard that. All right, so let's let's try. It. Oh, just kidding. Recent. What? Someone's screaming. Oh, it's locked. Can we use it? X. That's not the right key. Okay, so we have to find a key. It looks like maybe for these people. Uh, is there a key over here somewhere? Let's try running. So you go like this, and then you press R. Oh yeah, totally. Look at that. But we don't want to run a. We don't want to run near edges because then we'll fall off. Who's this guy? Hi. Ah, oh, the builder. Tell me, boy. Do the children of Hargon frighten you? Yes. You're. Yeah. Do you wish to flee from this floating coffin? Yes. These waters are cursed. Strange voices carry across the waves, and many a vessel has vanished into vapor. 
the crew victims to an unknown fate. Now, are you scared? Yeah, I'm terrified. Not as scared as I am, I assure you I'll be off this death trap at the first opportunity. Whoa, okay. Let's go upstairs, you guys. I don't know what to do down here. Okay, what does this guy want? Oh, this is not the guy that woke us up? Hi, why are you looking at me like I'm uh, breakfast? Look at that. Look at that face. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Uh, stairs are no match for you, I see. Nope. You just can't keep a good lad down. <laughs> now, as you'll no doubt have spotted, we're sailing on the open ocean. You've got no chance of escaping, so don't even bother trying. Okay. Not that you'd get very far, anyway. You're nothing but skin and bones. Oh, yeah? Well, you're nothing but bones. At least I have skin. <sighs> Here, get this down your gullet. It's fresh from the captain's table, which is where I sit, by the way. Okay. <laughs> Brandon obtains a piece of kelp. Yum, kelp. Okay, we can make some sushi. Brandon can't remember when he last ate. The thought of food makes his stomach start rumbling. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of hungry, you guys. Okay, edible essentials. Believe it or not, that kelp can be eaten. Select it, okay, then press X to eat it. Doing so will refill your fullness gauge and replenish some health. Just like Minecraft. Okay, so let's, let's select it and press X to eat. Okay. Look at that, we just ate something. Yum, okay. Great, now what do we do? Do, do we keep talking to him? Down in one, that'll, that kelp's pretty tasty, isn't it? The pungent aroma and slimy texture make for a spine-tingling combination. <sighs> you should thank your lucky stars you got to scoff such a scrumptious snack because it'll be the last meal you'll ever eat. Jeez. Yep. You heard me right. You'll be dead soon enough. But don't worry, you don't you won't be shuffling off this mortal coil just yet. I've got plenty of hard graph for you to be getting on with first. Okay, so we've completed one mission of several, I think. Talk to him again. Hey, 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 you can wipe that lily-livered look off your face. I'm not going to send you to the cemetery anytime soon. Whew. Anytime soon, hey. Okay. So long as you've got some life left in you, I'll be I'll give you a chance to keep hold of it, but you'll have to follow my orders to the letter. Okay. What's that? You want to know where you are and what you're doing here? Yeah. <laughs> that'd be that'd be great. Yeah. If you're that desperate to find out how far up the creek you are, I thought we were in the ocean. Without a paddle, I might add, go and talk to those five monsters beneath the flag over there. Beneath the flag. Three monsters will have a tale or two to tell. Beneath the flag. Oh. Right there are those that are all uh, flagged. Okay, let's talk to these monsters. <gasps> Oops. Oh, hi again. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. Just don't mind me. I'm just going to go right back over here and not fall down that horrible pit. Let's talk to this monster. Hello, Gumen. Slurp. We're the latest surviving members of the children of Hargoon. Hargoon. The ones who didn't get squished. Okay. We're going to bring this world to its knees. All in the name of the Gor Goriot and glorious high priest, Slurp. Okay. What's with all that... S oh. What's with all that slurping? I'm just salivating at the prospect of squashing you goomans once and for all. Oh, wait. Was that him talking? I'm not good with these voices today, you guys. Slurp, slurp, slurp. Okay. We talked to him. Okay, we have to talk to five. So we have to talk to, talk to the, these other four monsters. Ugh, this slurp keeps swaying from side to side. I feel a bit seasick. Oh, this ship, not slurp. <laughs> this ship. What's that? You want to know where we're sailing to? Yeah, that'd be nice. I haven't the foggiest. The higher-ups would never tell stuff like that to lowly little darky. Dracky? Dracky. That's Drackey. Okay. Talk to Drackey. Who's this little cute little... Look, look how cute these guys are. Look at that little tongue. Hi, little buddy. What's your name? Well, well, if it didn't meet the, meet the builder, you're only an apprentice, but you're prancing around like you own the place. <laughs> That's, I guess that... You know, when your, when your tongue hangs out like that, you kind of have to... You know. Honestly, you can't go anywhere these days without bumping into insults little builder's health bent on undoing all of our hard work. Oh, this is hard to talk like that. 
The world is going down the pan, that'll for sure. The only choice it is to eliminate the bothersome builders like you one by one. Okay. Oh, another one of the. Okay, I did the voice again. Okay. You are that apprentice builder that we nabbed in Cantlin, aren't you? Yeah, that's me. I must admit, I feel a few. A few pangs of. I can't do this anymore. Of sympathy for you, it is not very nice to know that your end is nigh. Ni, ni, he, he. That's his laugh. <laughs> okay, this guy finally. Middenhall, Kanarok, Moonbrook, from forth these three kingdoms did come the hated heroes, the Skyons of Edric, and lead almighty Hargon low. With his dying breath, our exalted leader surrendered his mortal form so that Malroth, the Lord of Destruction, could be born, alas! He too was vanquished. Oh no. But does that mean all hope is lost? No, I say, Hargon's ambitions did not perish with him. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but none day, but one day. <laughs> we will reduce this world to ruin. Whoa. There's a lot of story in this game, you guys. Okay, so we talked to these monsters. Let's go back and talk to our friend here and see what he says. Okay, hey, hey. So you talk to the rest of the crew, eh? Obedient little brighter blighter, aren't you? Yeah, that's me. Obedient little blighter. So you know, we're the last survivors of the children of Hargon, loyal servants of the mighty master of destruction himself. That means you builders are sworn enemies. Well, why are you helping me then? I'm your sworn enemy, but here you are helping me? We're sailing the ocean blue, rounding up pesky vermin like you along with anyone else who gets in our way. Great. Eh? You want to know what we're doing with all these builders? Yeah, what are you doing? What are you... Only the higher-ups know for sure, but I'll make no bones about it. <laughs> Get it? I reckon you a lot are up for the chop. Whoa. Don't chop me, please. Still, that doesn't mean we can't make the most of what little time you have got left. Just be thankful you can be some benefit as your final moment draws ever closer. Well, thank goodness I can help. Man. <laughs> okay, so now, I guess we talk to him again. He can tell us what else to do. Listen up, Builder, unless you want to spend the rest of your life behind bars. Or worse, you'll do as I say. Okay, fine, I'll do it. So here's the deal. Last night's storm messed up my ship good and proper. I want you to make things ship, ship shape around here again. Get it? Ship shape. To start with, I want you to break up all those driftwood strewn about the deck and bring me the wood when you're done. Go on, chop chop. Okay, each piece of driftwood is marked with an icon. Round up to them, press Y to punch it into something useful. Okay, I like that idea. Let's punch it. Punch, punch, punch. Let me steal some wood, okay. Can we punch those too? Nope. Okay, let's punch the wood. Okay, we got some wood. Punch this. Don't worry, Har Hargoon, or whatever your name is. We're not going to punch you. We might later, though. Uh, can you not get... Can you move out of the way? There we go. Okay. All right. So we've done eight of ten. So we just need probably one more stack, right? Yep. There we go. Okay. We cleaned up the deck. Let's go talk to him. Well, well. My deck looks much better now. Uh... Much better shape now. You've picked up all that wood. No files. No flies on you, eh? No. Still, I suppose being given the chance to save your sorry skin will tend to give you a kick up the. S -s -s what? What is that? <laughs> what? <laughs> you want to know why I'm giving you this chance? Yeah, why are you doing this, by the way? Truth is, as sworn servant of the Master of Destruction, I'm not supposed to fraternize with your kind, but considering the state of my ship, I've got no other choice. Okay. Now it all makes sense. Anyway, it's not like you're a proper builder. You're only an apprentice at the end of the day, so I'm sure it's fine. He wouldn't forsake me for a little thing like this, right? Well, he might if he's an old, mean, uh, mean monster guy. Who knows? Anyway, I think we've chewed the fat long enough. 
If you want to cling onto your life for a little longer, I suggest you continue working like that dutiful little builder you are. Yeah, it's me. Just remember, you can get all sorts of useful materials by smashing things up. Just be careful that you don't, that you bash. What you bash doesn't bash you back. Okay. Complete. All right, what do we do now? Do I guess talk to him again? You're an odd one. Since the moment I let you out of that cell, you've been scurrying about my deck and chatting with my crew without a care in the world. Nope. If anything, I'd wager you were actually enjoying this. There must be something wrong with you. I can't explain it any other way. Well, it is kind of fun, you have to admit. I mean, why else would you wear that droopy grin on your dopey mush? Faced with the same fate, most, pr most prisoners would be scared witless. But not you. No, I'm not scared of anything. Look at me. You what? You always look like that when someone's got a job for you. Okay. Hmm, it seems like you aren't scared of us at all. I better keep you busy, or who knows what you might try and pull. Yeah, I'm gonna sink your ship. You bag of bones. Luckily, there's plenty for you to be getting on with. For starters, some of the boys on the deck have got jobs that need doing. Report back to me. Okay, so basically we need to do some jobs. Whew. Okay, listen carefully to their instructions. Got it. Yeah, I got it. Okay, so let's go do these jobs for people. What jobs do you guys? Do you have a job for me? What's this guy's job? Hell's bells, what a sw what a storm we had last night. I washed up all the torches overboard and scattered my barrels around the deck. Okay, I beg your pardon. You say you slept right through it? Yeah, I did. I was tired. Good gracious, you must sleep like a particularly lazy log to have missed a humdinger of a hurricane like that. Yeah, <laughs> I, was, I was real tired. Okay, so I, we probably should go to the guy with the exclamation point. So let's go to him. What's up, bro? I've been watching you, Builder. I saw you scrabble around the deck, greedily pocketing all the wood you could find. Yeah. The raging tempest that struck last night washed all our navigation lights aboard. But such things can be rebuilt, can they not? Sure. To wit, I wish to... Uh, okay, so basically make some torches. Uh, okay, do you see the worn out? Yes, okay. Let's hurry this along a little bit here. Okay, so we need to make wooden torches. He's giving me some oil. Okay, Brandon obtains three splats of oil. Sounds messy. And we have some wood. Okay, so basically we need to make some torches and put them on the black posts. I'm just going to speed this up a little bit, you guys. Okay, you put a torch in each block. Okay. Do not fail me, Builder. Craft the five torches. Okay, we won't fail you. So, you can make some torches at the worn-out workbench using materials in your inventory. Okay. Let's go up here and let's make uh, some torches at the worn out workbench. We can make five. Let's, I think, what did he say? I think you need five. Five. Oh, we can only make three? Oh, crafts 15. Oh, I get it. Okay, may as well make 15. Why not? Sure. Okay, look at all those sweet torches, you guys. Great. Okay, so torches can be placed on top of other blocks. Select them by, okay, and then press X. Okay, so that sounds pretty easy. Okay, so we select the torch, like that, and then we find the block we want, and we place it by pressing X. Look how easy that is! We're lighting up the deck, excuse me! That's cool how it lights everything up nearby. I like that. Looks nice. And it lights up as we walk, too, since we're holding a torch. Okay, let's try and get it on top of there. Whoops. Okay. And then up here... I like the building mechanic in this game, you guys. It's pretty easy. Where was the other one? Didn't he say five? Oh, right there. Right by the crafting table. Okay. We did it. Okay, let's talk to him. Hmm, it seems I have done exactly. You have done exactly as I asked. The guiding flames burn brightly as before. Yep. For a sip such as ours, they could do with a bit being a touch more sinister, if I do say so myself. But I shan't complain. The deck is illuminated once more. Well, it's sinister enough. I must say, your propensity to create unsettles me. Not that it matters. You will soon outlive your usefulness. <laughs> These guys are so rude. <laughs> but your work is not over yet. Okay, so there's plenty more for us to do. We get it. All right. Complete. So let's see. Um, let's go find another person who has an exclamation point above their head. That guy does. All right. Hi. Okay, let's switch back so we don't have the light coming. Okay, here we go. Talk to this guy. Well, if it isn't the so-called builder, yes. Okay, well, you're suddenly right. Yep, okay. So what do you want me to do, buddy? 
You're running errands for the boys on the captain's orders? Yes, yes, please, give me a job to do. Okay, uh, as long as you're not afraid to put your life, sure, I can do it, I'm not afraid. Wonder whether builders can fight. Oh, you want me to fight, cool, okay. Fancy the thing is swing at this kid. Okay, so you want me to fight one of your friends over here. I can do that. <gasps> oh my gosh. What? But I don't have a weapon. Come after the fight's finished? What? Oh my gosh. Okay, I guess we have to block his attacks probably and hit him a couple times, maybe. <gasps> oh no, block, look. Oh, okay, I meant to jump out of the way quickly, but I didn't. Okay, ah! Ow! Okay, well at least he doesn't really hurt me much, and that was actually kind of easy. Skeleton was defeated. Yes. <gasps> He's coming at me again. Well, you're a better boxer than you look. Okay. Well, thanks for that. Punches don't hurt my pride. Uh, you're pretty bony for someone who claims to be a builder. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, it doesn't bode well. Okay. Luckily, you don't have a... Jeez, these guys. Go and tell... Okay. So, we did that. You fight worse than a wet washcloth. Did you guys... <laughs> That's funny. Okay, you fight, you fight like a cow's cadaver. You builders really aren't cut for combat. Wow. If I had a sword, maybe I could be. What's that? You would have smashed him to smithereens if you'd had, yeah, see? Yes. A likely story. You're going to bash him upside the skull with one of those torches? Yeah, but I'd like to have a weapon, please, sir. What's that book you've got? I don't know, I have a book? What am I doing with a book? Why do I have a book? What do I? Oh, I have an idea. Eureka, Brandon learns a new recipe. What? I did. Oh, cypress stick. A broken branch whittled to work as a weapon. Attack plus eight. Hey, that's better than just a fist, right? Don't just stand there smirking. Tell me what's so funny. I have a weapon now. I've got a weapon, I've got a weapon. You what? You just worked out how to make it. Yeah, I did. I'm smart. Well, I never. Are you telling me that builders can invent things? Yep. Builders are pretty cool. Don't just stand there right. Okay, so you want me to use the Cypress station, you know. Oh, okay, I can make a, on the workstation. All right. You equip it, okay. So let's go and make the Cypress stick now. On the workstation, right here. Build. Cypress stick. Yes! Attack plus eight. Uh, I guess we'll just make one. Okay. We did it! Yeah! Okay. How do I equip it? Uh, when you acquire a new weapon, select it with, okay, and press X to wield it. Okay, try equipping, okay, we can do that. So equip, press X, X. Okay, we equipped a cypress stick, yes! Okay, so now, here's the stick, look, look, I got it, I did it, I did it. The boy genius returns, cypress stick in hand. Now you really look the part, thanks. Got a stick now. <laughs> Okay, so you want me to go another round with this guy, with a bag of bones? Sure, I'll do it, yeah. I bet I'll do it a little better now that I have a stick. Okay. Get out of here. This time I'm actually gonna do it from behind. <gasps> no. Oh, look! That was crazy easy, you guys. <laughs> a bone-crushing defeat. Get it? Get it? Get it? <laughs> okay, Arg, yes. We did great. We did great. Okay. So his, his quest is done, so I don't think we need to talk to him anymore, right? Okay, just look at this, yep. All right, so who else is next? You feel a bit sorry for him? Yeah, I feel sorry, but can I have his sword maybe? I'd like that sword. <laughs> Thanks for that, Billy, it certainly has, okay, yep. Well, and that's what I'm here for. Okay, I'm not done with the day yet, all right. But that's complete, yay, great. So now, now, let's find the next quest. Oh look, there's an exclamation point down there. Now this guy wants something, finally. What's up bro, what can I do for you? My, my, you've been a busy little boy, haven't you? First you made those torches and now a cypress stick. Yeah, well, I'm full of surprises today. But you can hardly call oneself a builder without one's tools of the trade, yes, okay. Well, yeah, I'm a builder. Liar! The only thing you're carrying is that cypress stick. You haven't a single tool upon Yeah, that's true, I don't. Well, I think we had ought to do something about that, hadn't we? I confiscated this pair of gloves. Gloves? What? From the builder. In the brig yeah, in the brig below decks. Now they're yours. Why are you guys being so nice to me? You're monsters. Why are they being so nice? 
Okay, so we can smash things, hold them against, okay. Without further ado, take your new gloves, gather the, up the barrels, and strewn, okay. You want me to gather the barrels? Yay! Yay, look at these, new tool acquired. Pick stuff up and plunk it down. Plunk it down. All right. Use the gloves to move objects from one place to another. Press ZR to pick up something, put it down, and press Y while holding something to rotate it. Okay. So you want us to move the barrels probably to right there, right? Okay, so we press, what did he say, Y to pick up? Press ZR to pick up. Okay. And then we put it down with ZR. Okay, that's easy. Pick it up. Make sure it's in the right spot. Put it down. Tidy up the barrels. Two of six. We have six barrels to, to do. Okay, put that one back there. Yay! Three of six. Just a few more. This is great because this little uh, tutorial here is helping us figure out how we can uh, build stuff. Excuse me, everybody. <gasps> oh, jeez. Can you guys fix that hole, please? It would make it a lot easier to do things if I didn't have to worry about falling down this hole in the deck constantly. Okay, so here's the last barrel. Let's grab that. Let's take this over here. Here we go, sir. All done. Look at that. Isn't that nice? Wonderful work. Six perfectly positioned, but yeah, thanks. Yeah, okay. Thanks for the gloves, by the way. I was the impression that youth of today were nothing but a swarm of work-shy wastrels, but based on your showing up now, yeah, well... I'm a hard worker. No matter the blood or sweat tears you shed, servitude, okay, well, great. All right, well, yes, I know my fate is sealed and I know I don't have much time on this earth. Thank you for reminding me of that once more, you monster. It would appear to you have attended everyone's errands for now. Hurry along and inform the good captain that you require some more back-breaking chores. Do I have to? All right, more chores, please, Mr. Captain. Not bad, not bad. Looks like you've done everything the lads asked of you. Yes, nice to see a human working his fingers to the bone for us monsters. And without a word of complaint, I complained a lot. You just didn't hear me, because uh, if I doubted it before, I'm certain now you actually like this sort of thing. You're a proper weirdo, aren't you? Yep, I'm so weird. I'm so weird. Um, still, I won't be satisfied until I hear it from the horse's mouth. So to speak, do you enjoy building things? Yes, I do. He's all great. Yay. Okay. Can tell you from your fleshy face. My fleshy face. You've got all the makings of a master crafter. Yep. And that's why we can't let you live. Oh, great. Here, well, here's the end of the demo. I guess they kill us now. All right, sir, go ahead. Go ahead. Do your worst. Oh, he's not going to kill me. Well, with that, Builders, uh, a bit of mortal enemies, okay, sure. I'm sorry to say it, kid, but I'm going to have to sever that smiling skull from your shoulder. Oh my gosh! Oh, don't, no, please don't. <gasps> ah. Ah. Look at his face! Look at his face! Ah, oh, he was tickling my ribs. Of course he was. Don't look so scared. I'm really not going to lop your noggin off. Well, as long as you stay on <laughs> my good side, that is. After all, I wouldn't want to lose a willing worker like you. I reckon you've got what it takes to be a crank cracking little cabin boy. Okay. And what's more, I like the cut of your jib. What you say, laddie? You join my skeleton crew? Sure. I'll join. I have nothing else to do in this giant sea of emptiness. Man, this guy's talking a lot. What's the big book you've got? I don't know. It's a book. It's got stuff in it. <gasps> it's raining. Huh? Where did all this rain come from? The sky? Oh, no. Thunder. Lightning. Uh, okay. There's a storm rolling in. Oh, no. Where do we go? What do we do? Do we go in downstairs? An apprentice builder. You will do nicely. Thank you. Batten down the hatches, secure the poop deck, drop the anchor, or wait, I don't know. <laughs> this is your world to create, and yours to destroy. Okay, well, I'm not going to destroy it. I'm going to build, I'm a builder. Look at me. I'm a builder. And we're waiting for the game. Now come to me, my child. 
this the bad guy? This is this Mal Mal Malroth? <gasps> Oi, cloth ears! What are you gawking at? Didn't you hear me? I told you to get your fleshy rump below decks. Okay, so we need to get downstairs. Okay, fine, we're going. Jeez, fleshy rump. Oh man. Okay. Oh, there's an exclamation point. Let's go back here. <gasps> what? Whoa, what the heck's going on? I don't know. <gasps> oh no. Oh no 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 no. What's going on? What's what's happening? Captain, come to hold come to the hold quickly. What? Blimey, I don't like the sound of this. Hold tight, I'm on my way. What? Oh no, what's going on? You alright there, builder? Ah, but I can't be stopping to help you, human. Okay, what what do you need help in there? Hargon preserve us. This is bad. This is really bad. Oh, okay, you need help? Alright, I'm on my way. On my way. What's in here? Oh, jeez. What's going on? <gasps> the ship! It's sinking! Over here, builder! What's happening? What's happening? What took you so long, eh? I came right away. I've got bad news, builder. We've been swept right off the reef and the rocks are clean. <gasps> oh, no! Okay. Dave, Davy Jones' locker. I don't know if this will work, but try cramming a crate into the hole. Okay. Got a pair of gloves. Okay. Thanks for the gloves. So, cram the crate into the... Okay, let's grab the crate. All right, let's uh, cram that up there. Here, can I jump up here? Yeah, there we go. <gasps> Did it work? Yes! Well, that was pretty easy. Oh no. <gasps> oh no! That was a closer shave than I have liked. <laughs> you shave? <laughs> but you did it! You saved my bones. Not skin, obviously we know that. He doesn't have any skin. Oh, throw me a bone, not more beholes. Oh no, what? <gasps> oh no! There's more water. Okay, well, I, I, I can do this. Yeah, okay, put more crates. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I, I, I got it. Don't worry. I, I guess you're not gonna help me. You're just gonna stand there like a silly, the silly skeleton that you are. Okay, let's grab this thing. Oh, okay. So we have to get a crate up there. Can we jump up there? Yep. Okay. I'm gonna get another one down there. So let's grab this crate. Jump up onto this barrel here, maybe? Okay. We did it! We did it, my bony friend! Look at that! Look at the little monster! You're a lifesaver builder, or no, I owe you one. Yeah, well. Can you give me that sword? <laughs> the next wave. Oh, there's another wave coming? Where? <gasps> uh, oh, oh, no! Okay, I, I guess I have more holes to plug. Alright, here we go. Yeah, 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 I got it, 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 I got it. I'll take care of this. Okay, so we gotta do one here. Okay. And then over there, all right, let's grab this. Jump up here. Put that there. And then one more, I think. Okay, oh. Oh, man. Okay, here we go. Here we go, right there, there. We did it! We saved the ship! Can you not kill me now? I totally saved your ship, so can you be nice? Let's talk to him. You shored up my ship good and proper, Builder. I don't know where we'd be without you. Well, you'd be sunk. Shell hold for now. Oh, she'll hold for now. But who knows how much long... long. <gasps> oh, throw me a bone. We're done for. Oh, no. Oh, no. Here, 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 I got it. Let me just grab these crates over here. Plug the hole. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. I don't think I can plug up. Oh, gee. Builder, don't forget me, Builder. It was nice knowing you. What? Uh oh. Bye. Hi. Hope skeletons float. Oh no. Oh no. We're in the water. Oh. General Director Yuji Hori. Hi. The builders. We saw this earlier in the intro. <gasps> oh, that's. Ouch. Music. Okay. So these are the credits. <gasps> oh, are we okay? Oh, someone's grabbing our hand. Look at that. Oh. <gasps> Oh yeah! Builders! Dragon Quest Builders 2! 
I have a feeling we're gonna build some pretty sweet stuff in this series. So, the series, you guys, will be coming to Twitch. I'll be playing this for two hours a week, every single Sunday. Wait, Saturday, starting July 12th. It's going to be, uh, I think 10 a.m., 10 a.m. Mountain Time, every Saturday. You can build some, you can build round stuff. <gasps> Not just square things, you guys. You can, did you see that? The round, round towers. I think we can build round buildings. Ooh, and archways. Oh man, I can't wait to build a castle and a big castle town and fight a bunch of hideous monsters. Ooh. So it just, it seems like it's portal knights, but way cooler. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, there's building, there's RPG, there's adventure, there's leveling up, there's resources. It looks like a lot of fun. All right, it's loading. It's loading. It's getting there. Come on, onion, turn those pages faster. Actually, now that I see that little character, I realize it's not an onion, it's that little, that little slime glob we talked to on the deck of the ship. Whatever that thing was called again, that was him. That little guy. It's him turning the pages. Maybe he's going to help us. Maybe he's not a bad guy. I don't know. But he's a, certainly a good page turner. It's a good book. Um, oh. We're on an island. Brandon awakens on a sandy shore. It seems he was washed on a desert island. Along with the records of the skeleton's ship. He decides to take a look around to see what he can see. Okay. Thank you for playing the demo of Dragon. Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, oh, okay. Uh, please note that you can say, after this point, you cannot be saved. Okay, reverse the version of the game. Okay, so we can still keep playing, though. We can keep playing. Yes, we can keep playing, you guys. Let's play for a little bit longer. So is there a day-night cycle? There must be a day-night cycle, I think. That's pretty cool. So there's all kinds of cool stuff. Let's see what we can find here, you guys. So there's some kelp here. Can I break it? I can. <gasps> okay, so we have kelp. We can eat kelp. Can we gather the wood? Yep, we can gather supplies. Okay. I like the little uh, sounds when you gather stuff. That's pretty cool. Let's gather this. Oh, treasure chest, you guys. Treasure chest. Let's see what's inside here. Suddenly, Brandon hears a voice. Oh. There's nothing around here. Oh. The whole place is deserted. Oh. Okay, well then how did I hear something? The voice seems to be coming from the other side of the rocky outcrop? Where? Might be able to, to dig a hole through the sand to get to the other side. Okay, can I open this? What is this? Oh, more kelp, good, okay. Okay, I need to get to the other side. Is that that marker? Right there. Okay, let's go through here. Should we get this wood? Okay, let me pick that up. All right. So let's dig through the sand. How do we dig through, we just probably smash it? Yeah, that was easy. Okay, so over here. <gasps> Isle of Awakening, the land of infinite opportunity. <gasps> you guys, I can't wait to play this game. I'm so excited. The real game, the full version. July 12th. Whoa, look at that. So there's a bunch of ruins up here. Okay, buddy. Let's go. I guess we're going over here to talk to this nice person. Hello, this guy is such a strange color, yeah. Have I died and gone to heaven? Or hell? More likely? <laughs> Why more likely? <laughs> Have you been bad? Huh, what was that noise? I don't know. Huh, Spiky. Who the heck are you? Spiky? You making fun of my hair? It's not nice. Well, hi. You got Spiky hair too. Just in a ponytail. Okay, let's talk to her. Finally a live one. Say, you wouldn't happen to know how we wound up here, would you? Yeah, we were in a ship. I was sort of helping the monsters. You were on a ship that sank and then you woke up on this beach? Yeah. So how come you didn't uh, kark it too? Kark? Kark? Is that a word? What's your story? Ugh, I'm a builder. I have spiky hair. Your name's Brandon and you're an apprentice builder. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm not a monster accomplice, but no, I promise. I wasn't helping with the monsters. Huh, never heard of them before. Congratulations, I guess. <laughs> you guess, okay. My name's Malroth. Hey, you wanna see something gruesome? Follow me. Oh, okay. Wait, I thought Malroth was bad. Oh, I get it. They don't like Malroth because Malroth is good. Okay, it all makes sense now. All right. Okay, I'll follow you this way. All right. Come in. Let's, let's sprint, you guys. Oh, we can only sprint for so long before that bar runs out. Okay, good to know. This way. Oh. Oh, look, people. Hi. We're, weren't they the ones in the cells on the ship? That's what I call dead in the water. Bet you've never seen anything like this before. No, they're fine. They're just sleeping. They're okay. They're okay, aren't they? What's that? Do I remember seeing them? Yeah, I, I remember seeing them on board. Yeah. Oh, good. They're okay. Cough, splutter. Oh, what the? Oh. No, they're not dead. They're fine. Sounds like she's in a pretty bad way, though. She's in a pretty bad way. We should... Okay, yeah. No, we put her out of her misery. <laughs> Malroth. Jeez. No, we're going to talk to her and help her. Ugh. Arg. Gasp. Okay. Look at her. Look how cute she is. Look at her little hair. Uh, where am I? You're on... I don't know. We're somewhere. We're on an island. We're, we don't have anything but a stick and some kelp. Possibly a slime. Eep. You're p pirates, aren't you? Filthy free, free booting, free booting, B brigands who shall take me captive and demand ransom for my safe return. Yep, could use some money. We're pirates. Let's go get her, fellow pirate. There she goes. She's got a mouth on her, hasn't she? Yeah, well, you you should talk. There's only one way to make sure she shuts up for good. Oh my gosh, Malroth, would you just leave her alone? She's like. She wrecked on a. She's sad. She's scared. Let's go talk to her. Hi. Hi. It's okay. You're fine. We're not pirates. Get away from me, you villains. If you're going to take me captive, at least tell me where you and how I got here. Well, we're on an island with nothing but sand, rocks, a few corpses to keep us company. <laughs> you must have washed up here with Brandon when your ship sank. Yeah. Just a moment. Do I know you? Huh? Yes, I remember you. You're that builder from the ship. Yeah. I, we're we're around grinning while those horrid monsters. Barked orders at you, yeah. I knew you were in coots with them. No, I wasn't. So that means it's your fault. Well, you... No, 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 it wasn't me, it wasn't me. I didn't do it, I didn't do it. You're going to make the things we need to survive. Yeah, I'll do it. Okay. Even a rank amateur like yourself wouldn't be able to use that worn-out workbench outside to make the most basic essentials. I can do that. I'm Lulu, by the way. Now, that we need to hold on... Okay. Hi, Lulu. So we have a mission. Lulu's demands. Make a room. We'll need shelter from the elements while we wait to be rescued. I'd rather not die of exposure before then. Yeah, me neither, Lulu. At least two blocks high, and we'll need a door for getting in and out. There's a door already. Okay. Use the old shack. It's rather worse for wear, but I'm sure you can fix it. Okay. You can salvage some of the decking from the wreckage to patch up the holes. Just use those gloves of yours to pick it up. Okay. And then food. We have... So we need food. Okay. All right, we can do that. Bound to be a scallywinkle, a scallywinkle, or two on the shore. They're edible as long as you give them a good grilling on a bonfire. Okay. You'll need some wood. All right, so we need wood, scallywinkles, uh, driftwood, broken... Okay. Whew, she has a lot of tasks for us, you guys. Now, I can't be expected to put my head... No, okay, all right. Okay, beauty sleep. Straw... You want straw bedding, too? My gosh, she's demanding. Okay, bossy boots. Yeah, bossy boots. Okay, show you how mighty these muscles are. Okay, uh, yeah, we'll help you. Yeah, you Lulu, we'll help you. Okay, consider these little tasks. Okay, so let's do these little tasks. Yeah, yeah, okay, we got it, we got it. No, put her out of her misery. Gosh. No, 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 no. We know how to help her. Let's just help her. So it needs to be too high. So, uh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. All we have to really do... She's such a castaway. <laughs> okay. All right, Malroth, don't worry, I got this. I got it. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got this. Okay. Let's grab this. I know how to do this because I did this on the ship. And she said two blocks high, so we're just gonna put that there. And then we just have to patch these other holes. Let's grab this one. Put it here. And then this one. Okay. Oh. Needs to be like lit up. There we go. Okay. You're not gonna help, are you, Malroth? You're just gonna sit there and watch me. Fine, fine. I got this. 
I got this. Watch and learn, Malroth. Watch and learn. Okay. There we go. Sweet. Okay, so we did that. Now we talk to her, I guess. How's that building work coming along? I do hope you won't keep waiting too much longer. We did it! Okay, so the, make a room. Five of six. We'll need shelter from the elements while we wait to rescue it. I'd rather not die. Okay, I already got that. A door. Okay. Okay. So what are we missing? Yeah. Alright. We got that. Alright. Okay. Back. Okay, so... Oh, I see. I'm only missing one block. Okay, so let's grab this block. Okay. And let's put it right there. Yay! We did build a room! Nice! Okay. Brandy, you repaired my room. Yeah, Lulu. Good job. Now I have somewhere to hide to see... Okay, when the monsters attack. The monsters are going to attack? Oh, no. Can they not? Okay, so now what do we have to do? Proper place to stay. Okay. Mission. Make a room. We did that. Okay. Now we need to cook food in a bonfire. How do we make a bonfire? She seems pretty satisfied. Yep. Thanks to me. She wants us to cook Scallywinkle. Okay. I think so, but I don't know how to make a bonfire. Oh, look! Oh, Eureka! Brandon learns a new recipe! Bonfire? Bonfire? Yes! Bonfire! Okay. Uh, can be used to cook food. Big bundle of branches. Okay. What's the deal with that book? Well, it teaches me stuff. Yeah. Now you can build one. Yep. Okay. So, put together some wood, some oil. Okay. Oh, it just happens you have some oil. Well, great. Thanks for the oil, Malroth. Okay, so now we can build a bonfire. How do we do that? Okay. We need some wood. I think we have wood. I wonder how much we need. We have four wood. Yeah. So, let's see. How do we build a bonfire? Can we do it on this? Bonfire. Okay. One. Yes! It's funny that you use a wood crafting table to build a bonfire. Okay, where should we put it? Right here? So let's scroll over to the bonfire and place it right there. How do we place it? X. Okay, there it is! There's the bonfire, isn't it cool? It's hot as heck, and it's it spits and crackles. It must be a bonfire. Yep. But are you sure you know what you're doing with that? Not really. You can use a bonfire to cook food. Okay, select it, place food... Uh, stand near it, press X. Okay, that's pretty easy. Let's go over and get some of these uh, scallywinkles, scallywag things she was talking about. Are they over here? Let's run. <gasps> I think I see one. Want to ask me something? Sure. I keep hearing about making and materials and builders. Okay. It means that we make stuff. You smash things and find... Yeah, that's how that works. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Um, I don't know, actually. Yeah, that's the thing. We lost our memory, you guys. We need to get our memories back. Okay, yeah, sure. Scally, okay, well, yeah, we'll do that. I think I see one right here. Yes! Okay. Let's hit it. Come here, you Scallywinkle. Gotcha. Alright. Yeah, it's a Scallywinkle. Yeah, okay. Yep, yeah, okay. <laughs> Let's just get another one. Boom! I think... How many do we need? Does it matter? Okay, we'll just grab three. Cook some food on the bonfire. Look at that little guy over there. The little, the, that little guy. Do we have to fight him? I don't know, the little blue guys? Okay, so let's go, let's run, and let's go cook this on the bonfire. Okay, boop, got it, okay. How do we do it again? X, place. Oh. So A, cook. Okay, so that we cooked a scallywinkle thingy. Careful, Brandon. Yeah, okay. <gasps> it did. Must be how you cook it. Yeah, that's how you cook it. We did it. Food takes a little time to cook. Okay, so it's cooking right now. So we wait for the scallywinkle to cook. And then all we have to do is build some beds, which I don't remember how she said to do that. Scallywinkle time. Mmm, scallywinkles. Okay, let's take it. How do we take it? Collect. Okay. <gasps> Yay! Brandon makes his first seared scallywinkle. Mmm, scallywinkles. I love scallywinkles so much. Uh, that it's is that the smell of a succulently seared scallywinkle? I must have it. She's so demanding. Yeah, I'll hand it over. It's part of the quest. We'll do it. Oh, nom 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 nom. <laughs> All the scent of a seaside combines perfectly with the gravely crunch of the sand grains. Ooh. 
I hate that. When you eat a scallop and you bite into sand, it's the worst. Limit your culinary repertoire to scallywinkles. You know, you can see anything else that looks very edible. Try cooking it. Okay. Yeah. All right. So a cooked meal is much more filling than an uncooked meal. Okay. Just like Minecraft. All right. How rude of me. I just realized I never asked your names. Yeah, I'm Brandon. That's Malroth. Brandon and Malroth. Yep. It's weird that my name is in all caps. I probably shouldn't have put it in all caps. <laughs> yeah. Our memories are all blank. We don't really know what to do. His amnesiac friend. <laughs> We're partners. Yep. We're going to work together, you guys. Speaking of dreams, I'm starting to feel a little drowsy. It's been a long, stressful day. Yeah, let's make this bed. How do we make the bed? Straw bedding. I asked you to make. I'm really rather... Okay. How do we do that again? Oh. I learned a new recipe. Great. Straw bedding, I'm guessing. Yep. Bedding made from dried reeds plonked in a pile. Okay, so we need to collect some dried reeds. Here we go. Here's book. Yep. That's my book. It's pretty good. Okay, so how do we find straw bedding out of dry grass? Okay, so we need to go find some... Okay, along the shore to the west. Could that be what you're looking for? Yes. Can you tell me where it is? So, the west. So I guess we're going this way. Along the shore to the west. So let's go this way. Oh, those grasses. Do we have to fight those guys? I don't know. Let's hit that. So that's some dried grass. I don't know how much we need. Let's just, let's just collect a bunch. Oh, did you get it too? Oh, sweet! You guys, look at this! Okay, this is really neat that they actually help you. So if you have a mission... If you have a mission, they're going to help you collect stuff. That is so neat! Okay, we probably have enough now. Just collect a little bit more just in case. I don't know how many it takes. That is really neat. Talk about co-op. I love it. Okay, let's just collect a couple more along the run. <gasps> Do we have to hit this guy? Get off, get off. Oh, you earn oil from doing that. Okay, cool. So now we know how to get more oil. All right, let's smash this grass too. I bet we have enough now. Let's go make those that bedding. And then I think you guys, once we've done that mission, I think that's probably a good place to stop the, uh, the demo. This is getting me so excited to play the game. Okay, how do we do this? Oh wait, we have to craft it. So let's go out here and see if we can craft it. So what do we do? We need to... How many can we make? Can we make three beds? Make three piles, yes. Sweet! All right, we did it. We did it. So now we just need to place them. So let's go over here and let's place the first bed here. We'll place the second bed. Let's give ourselves a little bit of space so we don't like sleep right next to each other here. And then the third bed there. We did it. Oh, this is wonderful, Brandon. You made a bed for me and a couple of yourselves too. Yep. Taking a nap during the day will help to recharge our energies. Okay, cool, yeah. So we wanna take naps. All right, mom and papa would say, what? When the children of Hargon attacked my home, town of Rippleport, my parents were caught up in the fighting. Those m maniacal monsters murdered them in cold blood. That was rude. Those maniacal monsters. I mean, I guess you should expect maniacal monsters to do maniacal things. So I stowed away in that accursed ship, hoping to avenge their deaths, but I was caught before I had the chance to do anything. We all know what happened next. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Papa, Mama. I may be a marooned on a desert island with these two lumbering lummoxes. <laughs> <laughs> but I shall survive. I pray that you watch over me in these trying times. Okay. Anyway, thank you both ever so much. You're welcome. It's been a long, hard day. Yep, let's get some rest. We did it. Sweet. Great. All right. It's pretty cool that you can play this demo for a long time. I actually could probably keep playing if I wanted to. It's not stopping me. But I'm going to end the demo here because it's nighttime. All right, guys. If you enjoyed this episode, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps out the channel. I'm really excited to play this, so be sure you follow me on Twitch. There's a link in the description, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Have a wonderful day, and be sure you guys download this. It's free on the Nintendo Switch eShop, so check it out. It's a lot of fun. All right, bye, guys.